What is missing from this so-called party bike? Well, it's alcohol, but that may soon change. Yep, new at 5, 10 News reporter Michael Chen has the bill that could open the tap. I'm in the driver's seat of a party bike, and the keg you see in front of me, well, that is dry, something that could soon change with a new law. The tap is here. You've got seats, even a pitcher for tips. But amid all the fun, falls under the open container law. There is one thing you won't find on board. People don't end up booking because, you know, they, they want to drink on board. Laura Rovick, owner of Social Cycle. It's great for us. Is toasting a proposed bill that just passed the state Senate. <laughs> right now, these party bikes can pedal people to bars. No incidents, no accidents. But if the measure becomes law, it'll be bottoms up on board for each city that approves it. Other parts of the country already allow it. Uh, California is one of the few states that does not. A locking break there. The bill would also mandate statewide safety regulations. Driver Justin Hartley. Uh, our bikes are equipped with seat backs and uh, every seat is equipped with a seat belt. From seat belts to speed limitations to alcohol training, a set of rules for party bikes. It's a great way to, you know, show the city. That could allow people to drink on the road. Be able to have a beer on board, I think would be nice. Michael Chen, 10 News. And the measure does ban the driver from drinking, thank goodness. It limits the number of people to 15 pedaling at very slow speeds, they say. And the bill now moves on to the assembly. Looks like it could be fun, but it also looks like it could get out of hand pretty fast, too. Yeah, I think it'd have to be controlled. Yeah. Good point. Mm -hmm.